best friends on the catwalk, modeling items designed for pampered pets and proud owners. This wild zone at the Hong Kong Houseware Fair specializes in a wide range of veterinary services and products, from fashionable bedding to tempting toys. We feel the world of pets is becoming vast in, in, in inspiration for fashion industry. We're taking some leads off the fashion styles, using patterns in the fashion industry itself and adapting that into the world of pets. Hong Kong is a great hub for the pet industry and also Asia provides that nucleus of information which can be expanded into the rest of the world. We find a lot of people wearing, you know, carrying their pets, carrying whatever type of bag they have or whatever, they put it in, they want their pets close to them. So we designed that the pet sling in the backpack using footwear technology, air mesh fabrics to create the breathability to make the pet feel not too hot also loved by the parent. The parent, yes, by the family. <laughs> Nowhere are such families growing faster than on the Chinese mainland, where sales of pet products are climbing by an estimated 10 to 20 percent each year. For the dog's population in China is 27.5 million dogs in China. And then for the cats, it's 10.7 million in China. But an interesting figure is how do people spend? The breakdown for the revenue is 57.8%. It actually came from the cat's population. And the rest, 40-something, came from the dog's population. Good girl, all right. Well, as good of a dog here as Gucci is, she's not the only wild thing at the World of Pet Supplies. It's actually just part of the 27th edition of the Hong Kong Houseware Fair, which has attracted more than 2,000 exhibitors. Among them, this company which specializes in fine bone china. Man's best friend, only one of the elaborate traditional and contemporary designs found on their hand-painted creations, being snapped up by Chinese consumers with growing buying power. Innovation is also uncorking new markets with items like these high-tech corkscrews or trash bins with germ-fighting features. Many are offering products which reflect growing consumer demand for environmentally friendly products, a theme also explored at special exhibits to showcase innovative yet sustainable design. Economic challenges are being answered by the new small order zone to connect exhibitors and customers dealing in reduced quantities. Hong Kong's exports of household goods are on the rise, up 12% in 2011 to nearly 28 billion US dollars most to India, Japan, Germany, and the United States, where buyers are increasingly lured by quality design. Everything we do is uh, hand-blown art glass. Every piece is individually done, one of a kind, done by artists at our factory in Northeast China. Well, the Housewares Industry Home Decor Market is really after like the luxury, the high-end look. The high-end look is something that hasn't been available to a wide range of people for some time. We're able to produce at a good price, sell to a wider range of retailers, a wider range of persons interested in glass art. We come here uh, and we seek buyers for the product at an international level. Uh, we're pretty developed in the United States already, and so this is our, this is our reaching out to the international market. <laughs>